WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 214, NASDAQ up 150, S&P's up 39. Now, this is not what you wanted to see, folks, if you think the market's going to go higher or you're a bull. Because what we did yesterday, we pulled back with light volume, had the shot to basically get some real juice. Well, guess what? Now you're going up on even lighter volume. So that's telling me when this uh, Fed comes in tomorrow, we are going to go south. Gold. Gold contract up $4.90, trading at 1944 an ounce. We got silver up six cents, $23.80 an ounce. Light sweet crude up a buck twenty-one, $79.11 a barrel. Notes and bonds. A 10 year note up a tick, trading 114.17. The third year up four at 129.08 in King Dollar. King Dollar couldn't hold price once again, tried to get going, couldn't do it. Down 184 ticks, 102.092, Euro 108. Yen is at uh, one, where are you, Yen? Where'd you go? Whoa. Okay, there, 130 to one US dollar, and the British pound is at 123. We get over and we take a look at the SPY first. What you're gonna see, it's pretty clear, folks. Uh, bottom line is that you are going higher and you have a contraction of volume. We had light volume yesterday, so it ended up happening yesterday. SPY comes down with uh, 74 million, and you're coming into 84. Today, guess what? You're going up on 38. Not even close, man. The last high up here had 68. We're going to do about 48, 50 million shares in the SPY. We go into the NDX 100. We take a look at the NDX. Same type of setup inside the NDX. Yesterday, bottom line is that, you know, you come down with uh, 49. You were going into... 52, and now you're going up on 33, so we're going to do maybe about 45 on the way up. Gold, gold contract rejected lower price out here today. Gold got down to a price point of 1915. You're at 1944 right now. Um, hey, we'll see where this shakes out. This is, uh, what's intriguing about this, this is not a hammer. Uh, you know, you could look at this in the aspect. What a hammer is, folks, is that a hammer is at the lows, not highs. Uh, so bottom line, this is a hanging man versus a hammer. And we go to good old dollar. We take a look at the dollar out here, and it's all about the dollar, man. I mean, it, this is so uh, tight. The relationship is so tight, it's pretty amazing. So if we take a look at it, what you're going to see, we had a high today of 102,602, 607. So that baby, you know, finally got over its consolidation and then gave it up in spades. So I suspect... Tomorrow is going to be the day that uh, we're going to see lots of movement. 2 p.m. Is it 2 p.m.? Yeah, 2 p.m. tomorrow. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.